Friday night wearing their baby blue uniforms for the first time this season. The Marquette Golden Eagles hosted Alabama A&M in the program's first ever regular season game at the Al McGuire Center. Led by 51 points from the front court of Juan Anderson, Steve Taylor Jr. and Luke Fisher, the Golden Eagles would take down the Bulldogs in this game with a final score of 83 to 49. The Marquette men's basketball program has such an amazing history and tradition and obviously Coach McGuire is at the heart of that and to be able to be the first team to play an official game in the Al McGuire Center was a real honor for me and for, for our team. Playing away from their usual home court at the Bradley Center, Marquette was able to feed off the energy inside of the smaller Al McGuire Center Friday. The Golden Eagles thrived in the post against Alabama A&M, which is an area they've been trying to improve early in the season. The blue and gold posted 42 points in the paint, they out-rebounded the Bulldogs by 10, 32 to 22, and they finished the night with five blocks. The front court shot 19 for 21 from the field, led by sophomore Luke Fisher, who had another big game in his second appearance for Marquette, scoring 22 points while going a perfect 8 for 8 from the field and Steve Taylor Jr. collected 16 points to go along with six rebounds in 33 minutes to turn in a performance that Coach Wojo considered one of the junior's best games. You know, Steve had a really good week of preparation, and I love when guys invest and then they're rewarded from, for, from it. I think it also helps Steve at times not to be playing center. You know, he's, he's able to play in a more natural position at times when he's alongside Luke, so I think that helps him. Coming into Friday night's matchup, the Golden Eagles were shooting a mere 68% from the free throw line, but they would change things around against Alabama A&M, shooting a season-high 86% from the charity stripe, going 18 for 21 from the line. Scoring opportunities were in an abundance for Marquette as they tied a season-high for steals with 12 and turned those thefts into 24 points off turnovers to help deliver the 34-point blowout. Coach Wojo and his team of eight strong have been clicking on all cylinders recently and appear to be heading in the right direction with conference play on the horizon. Hey strong, baby, hey strong. I think our team is doing some really good things on the floor. Um, our defense continues to improve. Uh, we are sharing the basketball at a, at a really high rate, 23 assists on 30 made field goals. Uh, I think we're converting turnovers into points uh, much better. Um, over the last couple weeks than we have early in the season. So um, I, I like where we're headed, but we, we still are very much a work in progress. Steve Wojciechowski and the Golden Eagles will return to the BMO Harris Bradley Center Monday night to host North Dakota. Reporting from the Al McGuire Center, Mike Cianciolo, MUTV Sports.